Blessings to you, child of God. Blessings to you, family. I welcome you all to this session in Jesus' name. Father, thank you for today and thank you for the blessing of your word. Thank you for your presence and thank you for the manifestation of your glory. We pray, Father, that you will take the glory and the praise in Jesus' name. Amen. I have this word, the Spirit of God has been laying in my heart to share. I really don't know what title I'm going to give to this prophetic word. But let me share with you, every one of you that is watching, it's not an error that you tuned in and you're watching it right now. God is telling someone, don't be afraid to start just because so many people are doing it. This person, you've been trying to start up something, but at some point you thought about it and you felt like many people are doing this already. Why should I start it? Then it's so it's out there. Many people are into this. Why should I start it? The Lord is sending this word to tell you that graces are different. The hand of God upon people's lives are different. And you should not use your own ex or other people's experience to limit yourself. If, if God is laying in your heart to start up that business, to start up that channel, to start up that ministry, God is laying in your heart to maybe apply for that same job, whatever God is laying in your heart to do, just go ahead and do it. Just go ahead and do it. You will see the hand of God upon your life. You might come the last and God makes you the first. May God's grace speak for you in the name of Jesus. May God distinguish you from the crowd. May his favor speak for you as you go out to take out the step. May his favor speak for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Esther was in a competition. With so many other women, but the grace of God, the favor of God distinguished her. I don't know how many people are in the same field with you. I pray the favor of God will distinguish you in Jesus' name. Amen. Father, I'm grateful for your word. Thank you for what you are doing in Jesus' name. Now may the Lord bless you and keep you. May it cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord look kindly on you and grant you his peace. I love you so much. Shalom.